Welcome back to the channel, it's Ingim here, and in this video I'm going to teach you how to make a statue of a player for your Roblox game, just like this one in front of me. Alright, so let's get straight into the video. Alright, so first you're going to need the Moon moon Animator plugin, I'll leave a link in the description so you can go get that. It's free, so you will not charge you anything for it. So. To get in the character you just need to click on this character icon here and uh, it should load up your character but if you want to insert somebody else then you'll have to type in their username or their user id which you can find on the profile page. Um, this is fine, this is fine I'm just going to insert myself like this and I'm going to make myself a statue. So now we need to go into the moon animator so you can actually pose your character which is this. Um, icon up here and now you just need to create a new animation and um, give it a name so I'm just going to say um, statue pose because that's what it is I'm going to confirm it and I'm just going to add in the rig by selecting the character and clicking OK so now I've got my rigs in and now I'll be able to pose my character, be able to rotate all my body parts. So just uh, pose your character. So it's going to be a time lapse while I while I pose my character, and I'll be back once I've done. Alright, I've just posed my character, it looks absolutely terrible. Yours will probably be a lot better than mine. But this is just an example for the video. So once you've once you've posed your character, you just need to right click on your character and then export selection and then you need to just um, insert save this character somewhere. So I'm just gonna save it right here. So just give it a name, I'm just gonna say my for character just like that and now you can just close off this moon animator but you don't need to save it and I'm just going to get rid of all these so now what you need to do is you need to click on the plus at workspace and then click on mesh part then it's going to insert this weird looking part here with a weird texture on it um, so what you need to do now is you need to get your mesh ID you see this folder icon next to the mesh ID, click on that and it's gonna and then you need to select that uh, object that um, character that you saved before and then just when this thing comes up you just click yes then just press ok then it's gonna load in your character somewhere in the map so here's mine is it'll load up with no texture just as we want. Uh, now we just need to change the size, the colour and the material and everything. So I'm just going to leave mine this colour because it looks like a statue. Maybe if I change it to stone it might look a bit better. Whatever that is. Or slate. That looks awful. I think marble looks a lot better. But just customise it however you like. It's it's yours, do whatever you want with this. Make it look as much like a statue as you possibly can. Um, as you can create a podium for it if you want. And just place it on top and then customize the podium. Just like this. Oh, and make sure you anchor it to make it stay still. And like that. And there you have a then you have a statue of a Roblox player. So if this video helped anyone want to see more, then make sure you like, subscribe, and turn the bell to be notified when that video comes out. See so yeah, I'll see you in the next video. Bye.